some of my very, very rare Fortnite skins. So, uh, they're not really in any order, but we're going to be looking at all my rare skins. So, I thought this would be a really relaxing video. A lot of people have been asking me to do this, so, uh, let's start with, um, typing in some of the, I would say, Battle Pass skins that I have. Now, I wouldn't say this is, like, super rare. Uh, I don't really view the Battle Pass skins as being rare, so don't worry. This video is not going to be Battle Pass skins, but I did get the lights for the Omega skin, and I know that that makes that skin kind of rare, because not a lot of people did that. Uh, and the Reaper skin back in Season 3. Now, this is the first season that I bought the Battle Pass. And as you can see here, it's basically Fortnite's version of John Wick. I do have this skin. Great season. Uh, a lot of people kind of quit Fortnite before grinding to the end. So, uh, very happy with getting the Reaper. But let's move on to the actual rare skins. So, my first, I would say, kind of rare skin here is the up skin as you can see uh, this one was uh, was a Fortnite collab with uh, the movie in the series Tron so if any of you watched any of the Tron movies or shows you know what this is uh, they released a bunch of skins and I only have this one but it hasn't been in the shop for I think about 700 days or something so definitely starting to get rare right now kind of like this skin to be honest very very cool uh, there's two edit styles. Next, we have the Bravo Leader. I did not even know the skin was rare, but apparently it has not really come out again. Uh, it has a bunch of different styles to choose from, so you can definitely kind of customize the styles for this skin. Very, very cool. I need to use this one in some more videos. Uh, apparently this hasn't been on the shop for like close to 600 or 700 days as well. So definitely starting to get kind of rare. Uh, it could even be even more than that. Honestly, I have not checked in a while, but uh, yeah, surprisingly, that is a rare skin. Uh, let's see. Okay, let's go down here and let me think what skin to do next. Okay, here we go, the Shaman skin. So Shaman is a Fortnite skin that is definitely in my top three, I would say most rare item shop skins that I own. Uh, amazing skin. Look at the detail. Very unique design. Uh, whenever I wear this one, people always ask, like, where did you get that skin? Uh, there is another skin in this set, but that one actually came out recently, so it is not rare. It's like a witch skin, I think. But, uh, Shaman over here is not, uh, is not a, you know, common skin to see, so this one hasn't been back for like a thousand something days, like a thousand three hundred. Over here we got Honor Guard. Now, Honor Guard is not an item shop skin, so it's not rare, like the Shaman skin, which hasn't been back for like a thousand three hundred, twelve hundred days. Honor Guard is a skin that you can only get for a limited time uh, by buying stuff for Fortnite, like a cell phone. So, uh, a lot of people did not get this skin. I think it looks amazing. I love the shiny kind of blue color helmet and jacket that comes with this skin. I think it looks amazing. And my favorite color is blue, so I'm very, very happy with this skin. I know it's, a, you know, not that popular, but I really like the blue style. Next, we have John Wick. Now, John Wick, there are technically kind of two John Wick skins in Fortnite. We got Reaper, and we got John Wick officially in the game. Uh, this skin has not returned to the item shop for quite some time. Uh, I think it's been like 800 days, possibly, since we've seen John Wick or something on the shop, so it's been a while. I have this version. Uh, he has two different edit styles. A clean suit and a version of the suit that's completely destroyed. <laughs> kind of like that version. Great skin. Love the John Wick movies. Kind of sad that they never brought the skin back for the fourth movie. Over here we have one of my top three most rare Fortnite skins from the item shop. The Demogorgon skin from Stranger Things. So, I love Stranger Things. I watched the show on Netflix when that first season aired, like, the first day, because I was already excited for that series. And uh, as soon as this came out on the item shop, I was super excited. 
Uh, I did not get Chief Hopper, sadly, which is also rare, but I did get Demogorgon, and uh, what a creepy and interesting looking skin. <laughs> Has not come out for a very long time. Next, we have Kratos. Now, the interesting thing about Kratos uh, is from God of War, so this is like a gaming collab with Fortnite. But, uh, apparently some of the gaming Fortnite skins are starting to get kind of rare. I know Master Chief is kind of rare. Kratos is, uh, I think at the top of that, that list. And I know Psycho Bandit is kind of rare as well. But, uh, there are two versions for the Kratos skin. There's the default, regular version. And if you buy a PlayStation 5 and sign in with your Fortnite account on PlayStation 5 and you play a match, you unlock this special uh, Kratos Golden Armor uh, style, which I think looks amazing. So that's special for PlayStation 5 owners. There's something special for uh, Master Chief, by the way, if you play on Xbox Series X. So over here we have the Surf Rider skin. Um, now, this is not as rare, I would say, as Honor Guard, but Surf Rider is still kind of a rare skin. Um, you can only get this skin during a limited time for a, like, Intel website collab with Fortnite. You have to sign up there and link your Fortnite account to your Intel account. Uh, I think you had to do some kind of, like, questionnaire uh, thing. It's been a while, but uh, you can't get the skin anymore, last I checked. But, uh, it was there for a limited time a couple years ago, and I really like the color blue, so had to get that one. Uh, let's see what's next. Uh, let's go with this. So, Glow, technically, this skin is not that rare, but in another way, it hasn't been on the shop or hasn't returned at all since it released. So, this was a skin that, if I remember correctly, was completely free. Uh, you just had to be playing Fortnite at this time, and a lot of people, uh, you know, got the skin, but a lot of those people don't play Fortnite anymore, and they never brought the skin back. It's a special kind of new style of the Fate skin, and honestly, I think this version uh, looks way better than the Fate skin. Glow is awesome, so it's kind of a rare skin. Next, we have one of my rarest skins. I don't know if this would be at number one, but... Wonder is amazing. It's kind of like a very colorful version of the Shadow Ops skin, if any of you know that skin. Uh, this skin just screams like, I'm rare, look at me. Like, it has like a light green color, you know, hair. The actual, like, clothing is like a bright, kind of like magenta, purple color very shiny, very bright, and in your face. Whenever I use this in my games, people try to chase me and finish me quickly. I think a lot of people are jealous they don't have the Wonder skin, especially in Arena, so it's a dangerous skin for me to use, but it's one of my rarest ones. You could only get that a long time ago. Over here we have Wingman. Now, Wingman was one of the kind of like starter packs that Fortnite was doing early on. Uh, this is their second starter pack. I have to be honest, I did not like their first starter pack, so I did not buy that one. But I like the color red, and I really like the helmet, and I thought it looked cool, so I got this one. And, uh, yeah, this is super rare. It has not re returned since, like, Season 4 or Season 5, whenever this came out. So, yeah, Season 4, uh, Wingman is super rare. Over here we have Psycho Bandit from Borderlands. So, this skin came out a long, long time ago during uh, the original Fortnite map. They had a collab with Borderlands, and this skin released. And then the skin did not come back for a long time. Fortnite, though, recently brought it back in a special way, where if you pre-ordered a Borderlands collection on PC, they would gift you this game on your Epic Games account if you bought the game on their shop with your Epic Games account. A lot of people didn't know about that, so this skin is still pretty rare. It has not returned to the shop since. Next, we got Astrojack. Uh... I honestly like the Astro Jack skin more than the Travis Scott skin. I just think it's way more unique. But, uh, yeah, this came out during that legendary Travis Scott 
uh, Fortnite performance uh, concert event has two amazing styles. Honestly, I don't know which one I like more. They are both really, really good. I love the shoes in both of these uh, styles. Great skin, super rare. Uh, it has not returned at all since that original Travis Scott concert. Oh, I love the animation on this, it looks amazing. But uh, yeah, let's keep it on the default style. And let's see, <laughs> that looks so cool. By the way, check out one of my rare, kind of like OG season Fortnite wave emotes there. Uh, let's see, here we go. Now this is a more recent rare skin. I remember when this came out, I bought it, I thought, hey, this looks like a skin that's kind of unique, might become rare. And it exactly it is what happened. Like, it became super rare. It never released again. Um, honestly, kind of looks like a fashionista, kind of like Paris fashion designer outfit. Reminds me of something, you know, uh, kind of like Prada or something like that. Kind of cool. I know Prada is not a um, French fashion brand, but definitely kind of gives me that kind of like fashion brand design. France kind of cool. Love the red style. Uh, the second style is alright, but I just think the red one looks amazing with the skin. So, Rue. Uh, let's see what else. I'm trying to think of other rare skins I have after Rue. Here we go. We have the regular Travis Scott skin. This is the one that everybody bought. I would say Travis Scott is a little bit less rare than Astro Jack, just because more people bought this one. But, uh, the skin has not returned at all since its original release. And, uh, it's a super cool skin. I love all the detail with the tattoos. Travis looks amazing. They did a great job kind of capturing, like, how he actually looks, his face and everything. I love the shoes that come with the skin, too, by the way. The Air Jordan, you know, Travis. Oh, man, looks so cool. Um, let's see what other skins... Other, here we have Derby. Now, Derby Dynamo was like a Fortnite pack. Um, I bought it because it came with a special built-in emote that was awesome. But uh, Derby, ever since this skin first released, never really came back to the item shop, so it's kind of rare. Uh, there's a Flamin' Dynamo style with the flames, everything's on fire. Kind of cool. Reminds me of the Malice uh, skin. We got Minty Dynamo. And we got the default version, so it's kind of like a roller skating Fortnite skin. I think it looks awesome. I love that it has a built-in emote. And uh, yeah, apparently this skin is kind of rare. People really want that one to come back. Uh, let's see, I'm trying to think. Here we go. So over here we have the fish stick skin, but there's a catch. So fish stick is a super common skin that everybody probably has or has seen, but there is a special style. See, there is a World Cup style for Fish Stick that was only available during the World Cup, uh, Fortnite World Cup. So, um, if you did not own this skin before the World Cup finished, there was no way to get this special style. So, a lot of people do not have this because they bought Fish uh, Stick after that World Cup event where Booga ended up winning. So, uh, yeah, this version is kind of rare, so I have that. And lastly, Black Widow. This is probably my number one most rare Fortnite item shop skin. This skin has not returned ever since it first released. This is the original version of Black Widow uh, Fortnite early on. Uh, you can see here there's a blonde style and the red style. Fortnite early on did a collab with Marvel, but they only released like two skins. They released Star-Lord and Black Widow, and that was for like the Thanos kind of Avengers collab with Fortnite. Uh, people are really sad that we didn't get like an Iron Man skin or Captain America. We got those later, but uh, yeah, this is the rarest skin. Never came back. Uh, I think it's like a thousand seven hundred days or something crazy. It's been a very long time. And as you can see here, uh, this is a newer version of Black Widow, which comes back a lot. But this one, this one has not released ever since that season. And uh, it's my number one rarest Fortnite item shop skin. So, <laughs> kind of kind of am happy I have that one. Uh, let's
let's see. So, I guess that's it for my rarest Fortnite skins, but I have some honorable mentions here. So, I have Major Laser. This one is starting to get kind of rare. So, yeah, I have Major Laser. Uh, let's see, what else, what else? I have the dude skin from a free guy. If you're a Ryan Reynolds fan, you probably want this skin. Uh, this one is also starting to get kind of rare. Uh, what else? Let me see. Here we have the snake eyes skin. If you're a G.I. Joe fan, you probably know who this is. I had to get this one. Super cool Fortnite skin. This one also is getting kind of rare. Uh, Jinx. Now, Jinx is more of a recent uh, Fortnite skin, but this one has not returned. And there are a lot of Jinx fans out there that want this skin. And, uh, yeah, if it doesn't come back for another year, this is definitely going to be even more rare. Uh, let's see. Okay, so Blue Team Leader I don't have on this account. But I do own Blue Team Leader on my other Fortnite account. And that was a special kind of PlayStation uh, skin that they gave to PlayStation Plus subscribers. And I have that. And uh, over here we have Batman. Now, I have this Batman skin and another one. I'm not sure why it didn't appear. Let me just go look for it. But uh, apparently one of these versions of the Batman skin is kind of rare from what I've heard. I don't know if it's this Dark Knight movie version or if it's the other Dark, uh, or not Dark Knight, but the other version of Batman. But uh, one of these is kind of rare from what I've heard. And uh, let's see, here we have Tropical Punch Zoe. This came out as part of a pack with uh, three skins. Uh, it was like a summer skin pack. And uh, this one is also kind of rare. A lot of Zoe fans out there, and they want that pack. And it's not out on the shop. Maybe it'll come back, maybe it won't. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for my rare Fortnite skins. So let me know in the comments. What do you think of my rare Fortnite skin collection? Do you own any of the skins that I have? Let me know your thoughts on them. And thank you for watching and listening to this video. So long.